you know, it's, Tell me. if it had like ham in it, <laughs> it's, oh, no. it's closer. Oh, no. It's closer to a British carbonara. Oh no! It is. No, that's true. Oh well, nice. well, I'm glad you're standing yeah. there. Do you agree? Yeah, 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 yeah. But you know what I mean. If my grandmother had wheels, she would have been a bike. <laughs> you know what? You know. <laughs> <it's>... <laughs> You know, what the hell is, you know, it doesn't make any sense what you said. It's a different recipe. It's got nothing to do with the uh, macaroni cheese. You know, what? Well, <laughs> how random is what? Can, uh, uh, please, anybody help me here in the kitchen? Oh, God, my God, he choked. <laughs> oh, man. Stop it. Oh. Uh, this week, Derma Gavin pays a visit to Birds of a Feather star Leslie Joseph's London Garden, where he enlightens her about the endless possibilities uh, an inner city <laughs> plot <laughs> can provide. <laughs> Did I make that sound interesting? <laughs> Dear. I'm, I think we could have sold that slightly better, don't you? <laughs> I mean, that... You know when you don't know whether it's actually gone in because it's so smooth? I mean, it's been a drink for... <laughs> and then You've it's... got to wee into no, that! you don't wee into it! B-Day don't wee into a B-Day, <laughs> do you? Oh, you have to clean your... yourself! Cleans your bits! Oh, I thought you meant... <laughs> Have you been oh, weeing no. all these years? Why are there two toilets in my hotel room? <laughs> 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 oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> all these years. <laughs> that one hasn't got a seat. Brilliant. Fuck. That's his little puppy. <laughs> He's making little noise. I swear to God, it just went... <laughs> and I thought, I thought it was you. <laughs> I thought, not only has she done that, she's also stopped. I'm <laughs> <laughs> so sweet. Turn it off. How do you turn it off? I, I don't know. know. I've still got a mouthful of beef. <laughs> 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 Not again. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> no, 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 thank you very much. Pleasure. Plastic Miss Towie's Gemma Collins, guide to figure flattering frocks. Oh, that's after <laughs> It's pantry for me. I think it might be pantry for me too. Definitely. I reckon you have more fun downstairs. Do you think? <laughs> oh, God, I love you sometimes. Oh, gosh. And Zoe's going to be telling us how much fun you can have with a lampasander. Oh. Oh, with a what? Not to be Miss Lampasander. What's that? So it's an Indian curry. Oh, I think you said it. I thought it was like a sander, like a type of. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was like a sticky one. Well, what happened? Oh, fun God, yeah, I was going to sand that lamb down a bit. <laughs> OK. It's your last chance today to win the ultimate VIP adventuring mini holiday. What? <laughs> Here's the competition. Oh, no, nothing. <laughs> you are one of the six million, aren't you? I have never gone to sleep with it in my hands. So he... So <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, dear. Uh, a bit of fish pie today. Well, fish from Phil Vickery. Mm. I don't know it's actually sort of pie, but uh, would you have a go at that yourself? It's not your favourite thing, is it, I'm fish? not so good for... Yeah, I like, like, fish in a finger. <laughs> 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 but, uh, thanks. So is that Lynette <laughs> laughing at me on the same That's one? the... Uh, that... Go. See, it's all right when, she've, when you... Once it's in, I love it. But nice, you see? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, welcome back uh, uh, to this morning. 
<laughs> no, we haven't got time to do it now, but can you just stay and do me? <laughs> that sounds uh, like an offer I'm not going to get again, so uh, absolutely. And we'll just cut to an interval just now. And Umbledon. Umbled Engelbert. <laughs> I'm going to practice that and I'll have it right tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Come back now. Last week, Phil Vickery had some truly spectacular encounters with a wild bear and a humpback whale. <laughs> not, just... <laughs> not just one, a few. This is why it sounded a bit too personal. Wild bears and humpback <laughs> whales. There were lots of them, wasn't there? Yes. Right, in the second instalment of his Alaskan adventure, he gets rather friendly. <laughs> Oh my god. Now he's gonna get you know he's gonna get friendly with the local seals. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But no, I've never whizzed it over the kitchen. No. <laughs> I should hope not. <laughs> 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 My husband eats winkles and I can't watch him. Well there winkle. you go, see? <laughs> that that is a winkle, well, isn't it? <laughs> that's his affair. <laughs> What are you doing your own times? Absolutely. Hey, absolutely. <laughs> that's that's your weekends, love. So, <laughs> so <laughs> should, should, should we just move on? Yeah, Seriously, since you've been up the fluff or whatever it's called, <laughs> it's been. Uh... <laughs> well, how do you say again? <laughs> we had this conversation this morning. You've been a nightmare to cook with. <laughs> up the fluff, I think, is what you're. Okay. Well, you know what I meant. Uh, this. Just came out. What the hell was that? I don't know. Oh my god. <laughs> so, <laughs> so there we are. Uh, and there's our there's our best bit for a Thursday. <laughs> uh, I don't think I realised that turkeys had testicles. OK. Or yeah. where they put them oh. at Christmas when you get your where turkey. Where they put them at Christmas? <laughs> where does a turkey put its testicles at Christmas? <laughs> it sounds like a joke. <laughs> What's the punchline? It's Santa's sack. <laughs> <laughs> you can't say anything else now. Because lasagna is one shit, all right? Lasagna is two shits. So that is the way to do it. So it is lasagna, lasagna. Now, the first thing we want to put on, there we go. Okay. A little bit of olive oil goes in the frying pan. We're going to make them. Oh, oh, oh. I mean, I still remember cockabell, to be honest. <laughs> Could you ever forget? <laughs> anyway, the dog managed to find its way home. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> Funnily enough, I've never willy wanged since then. <laughs> 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 Kim, Kim actually got 16% of the That's surprising. Well, there you go. She is, she good, is value. good value. That's yeah. true. All right. So we're answering <laughs> that. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, we really love it too. We really, really, really love it too. <laughs> I can't believe we both did it. it. I can't believe we both did it. Oh, yes. No, she I'm taking that as a meal. I forgot we're on the telly now. <laughs> Just having a chat. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, man. Right. right, how would you like to holiday like an aristocrat? That's, that's, oh. <laughs> that's the cartoon oh. my kids really like. An aristocrat <laughs> would be what I actually mean. Oh. <laughs> it's Joe Joyner with details of how you could win a luxury. Welcome back to Dancing on Ice. <laughs> Welcome back to Dancing on Ice. Oh! <laughs> Show. I knew it was a long show, but it's When have you that. ever stood on Dancing on Ice with an egg on top of a bottle? Come on, that should have been the giveaway of which show we're doing. And I can't say carogotically. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. Categorically. <laughs> Categorically. <laughs> As I said, I can't say it. Ca <laughs> Carrotgotically. <laughs> yeah, no, you can't say carrotgotically. You're absolutely right there. <laughs> 
That's my best bit. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> I can't say for sure <laughs> if it's actually worked, but I'm going with it because at the moment... Come back, how do you fancy 20,000 people, a brand new car and a trip to the Maldives? Did you know what you said? <laughs> no, what did I say? How do you fancy 20,000 people? <laughs> did I say that? <laughs> how do you fancy 20,000 pounds, a brand new car and a trip to the Maldives? Be a big car, well, I've never it? seen that happen before. <laughs> Apparently, ridding a horse a house. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know why I said that? Because I read it first of all as riding a horse. <laughs> and then I thought, it's not riding a horse, it's a house. And then I said it anyway. Uh, oh, gosh, <laughs> ridding a house, I mean, spirits. Oh. So, if you don't know how to... Should, oh, sorry, if you don't know your... <laughs> I'll start that again. So if you don't know your shiitake, or you... <laughs> or you want advice on how to make the most of your mushrooms, email this one. <laughs> that was that was your best ever. <laughs> oh dear. Um, so number one in the states when you were born was celebrate. <laughs> Don't cry, I'll celebrate. Oh. Other people born on the. T I'm going to carry on here and just see how much we can make you cry. <laughs> Other people born on the 10th of February, including Roberta Flack. Oh, uh, I didn't know that. Robert Wagner, the American actor. Uh, Andrew oh. Johnson, the English footballer. And Queen Victoria of the United Kingdom married Prince Album of Saxe Coburg Gotha on the 10th of February 1840. Wow. On this day. That's, a, that's a good day. Do we have a phone call? Hello. Hello, Dan. Hi. Hi, Dan. You get her back. <laughs> Hello, darling. Hello. We, we can't wait for you to come home, all of us. The kids are so excited. Don't. I'm going to start with you. you. We, on, uh, we were talking about it this morning. I think Belle thinks she's got the sack. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I just wanted to say, um, have you made the announcement yet yeah, that we're having a baby girl? Yes. Tell everyone. <laughs> no, <laughs> we really don't. They know. don't know. <laughs> We are. Oh, I think it's a girl. <laughs> no, we are. It's a girl, everyone. It's a girl. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to hand you... Uh, Dan, we got to go. Thank you, Dan. Go. Good luck, oh, Phil. Good luck, Mandy. Don't miss you all, Mandy. I'll Keep see you immediately there. after. Yeah, Look at what exactly. we've done to oh, <laughs> On tomorrow's show, it. Lacey Turner, Jason Manford and uh, Martin Lewis. Oh, we've made a right on mess of your makeup. No, I know. I'm so, I just, you know, I'm just going to miss you all. That's all. It's such a lovely show. Not as much as we'll miss you. I know, I know. I'll be watching. I'll See be you watching. on Monday. Well, you just had a baby, didn't you? Well, I ate, I ate sometimes food a lot then, <laughs> but that doesn't count. Well, what's your baby's name? Um, well, I've got a little baby called Belle, Aww. and then I have a two a two year old called Harry, who's got your signed picture on his wall. Really? Yeah, oh, he loves hello, him. Harry, and, oh. and welcome to the world, the world, Belle. Ah, oh, that's lovely, Elmo. Um, thank you for thank you very much for coming I know, back. Thank you. Um, Elmo's World is on Channel Five. A milkshake Aww. starts at six thirty-five in the morning, Thanks. and uh, and that's from six till nine every day. And uh, you're going to love that. Um, we're thank back you. after the news. The, the the thing I know this is upsetting I you. I know this is upsetting you. I know, I know you do. I know you do. Um, but on a positive note, as you say, on a positive note, the one thing the one thing we have out of this is that. As painful as as it is, and I do agree. With, I totally, I, and this is why it's important to talk about it. I totally get that, but it's a hard subject, a very hard subject, particularly when you're talking about very young children. And I think the grooming process is really important. When devoted mother Kate Green discovered that her breast cancer was terminal, she compiled a list of things she'd like her husband to do with their children in her memory. From kissing the boys two times a night to finding himself another wife, Kate wanted to help the man she loved create the best life for their sons when she was gone. Well, Kate sadly passed away in January 2010, aged just 38, but her memory lives on. And her husband has made Kate's life lessons and their love story into a book called Mum's List. Yeah. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> and uh, we've... Um... I'm sorry. You're OK. Um. Oh, I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, boys. Her, come over and give her a cuddle. Give her a hug, Come over and give her a cuddle. Give her a hug. Come over and give her a cuddle. Give her a hug. Come over and give her a cuddle. Give her a hug. Come over Come over and give her a cuddle. Give her a hug. Come over Come over and give her a cuddle. Give her a hug. Come over and give her a cuddle. Give her a hug. Come over and give her a cuddle. Give her a hug. Come over and give her a cuddle. Give her a hug. Come over and give her a cuddle. Give her a hug. Oh. Look, listen, let's finish the interview on this side. Come over here. Come okay. on, we'll all sit together. There we are. Cool. There we are, guys. Holly in the middle. Holly in the middle. There we are. 
Come on, ask us There we are. There we are now. We've all got the cuddle now. Yeah. <laughs> That's what we were going for. Oh. Uh, thank you very much. Hey, no worries. Lovely thank to, you. Lovely to meet you. Lovely to meet you guys. Mm. And the best of luck. And will you please do me a favour if you do the thing through the museum that you take a picture and send it to me because I would so love to see you do that. Yeah. 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 Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank you very thank much. You.